So here I'm going to show you how to solder a number of different things. I have this little diamond that's already set. They want to put a bail on it. I have some earrings here that are going to put protector uh, posts and backs on. Uh, I have a pair of settings here that are going to become hooplets. And over here, I'm just going to put one post on because they already have uh, one earring. The customer lost one. So uh, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, get moving on this. The most important thing to do when you're soldering is to make sure that you can hold things still and that you can see what you're working on. So basically, I'm just putting this in like that and making sure it's straight. This is a little harder to hold on to because of uh, the various places, highs and lows on the piece. Now what I'm gonna do there now is I'm going to, first I'm gonna put some solder on it. So I'm going to put some flux on. Now I'm gonna go for some solder. So here I am putting the solder on the piece, I'm getting ready, and there that's flowed. And now I'm going to take the bail. This is the customer's bail. Wouldn't be my first choice, but I'm going to utilize it. I'm going to put some flux on the piece, flux on the bail, and then I'm going to go ahead and just come in here and I'm going to attach it. Okay, I'm going to turn it a little bit. And then I'm going to look at it. See how that how it lays. It lays flat. How it looks there. And I'm going to move it because it is not straight. So I'm going to put it back in here. And I'm going to go ahead and let's see how that looks. That looks good. Yeah, that looks good right there. So there's the first one. Now I'm going to go ahead, uh, since I'm working in white gold, I'll just stay over here. I'm gonna put these in. I'm gonna apply some jump rings on here for doing the hooplets. Once again, make sure you have a way to hold on to things that they stay still. I'm gonna apply some solder To where I'm going to put the jump ring. Okay, so there's that. I'm going to go ahead and do that. Now I'm going to take a pair of pliers and hold on to these jump rings. The more you get things to stay still, the better it is. Now I've put flat spots uh, on the setting where I am going to put this jump ring, and I have also put a flat spot on the jump ring. And so I'm going to heat up the, the piece just like that, and that's on, just like that. Let's take a look here, and that's perfect. Now I'm going to take the other one, boric acid and alcohol, and I'm going to put it in, put it in the clamp, hold it tight, and then I'm gonna grab some solder. Put that on there like that, load on there, put some flux on here, then I'm going to get my jump ring with a pair of pliers. And do that, I'm gonna grab some flux, like that. And 
Go ahead and start warming the piece up. And the solder's flowing. And that's on. <laughs> Sorry. And so it, there we are, it's on. Now I have one earring. It's a solid close back. I'm gonna put some boric acid and alcohol on it. I'm going to go ahead and get a hold of it so that I can solder that post on. So I'm gonna level it off. There we go. And I'm going to go ahead and get some solder. Like that. Then I'm going to get some flux and flow that on like that. And I'm going to get the post. A little bit of flux. Heating it up. You know, almost up to flow point. That post is on. I'm going to pull it forward a little bit more. A little bit of an angle. That's good. See, so that post is on there now. That's one other one. Now I'm going to take these flower earrings and I'm going to put some protector posts and eventually some backs. So now I'm going to switch over to yellow gold solder. I'm using 14 karat yellow gold easy. A little bit of flux. There's the solder, just float on. Now I'm going to take a post. And after I pick it up, put it in a pair of pliers, a little bit of flux, get it at a good eye level here. Now I'm going to bring the solder almost up to flowing again. There it goes. And the solder has just flowed on. See what that looks like. That weighs good, and that weighs good. See, that's on. If there's any adjustment I need to make, uh, I can go ahead and do that after, but it's, it's on there good. So here's another one. And I'm going to put some flux on. Now I'm grabbing some solder. Flux again. Then I'm going to get a post. I'm going to, like I said before, I'm going to flow the solder or up to the point of flowing the solder here so that, and I do have the post close to the heat where I am trying to warm it up. You know, I'm gonna move it a little bit.
and that's good. So, the soldering for the day here.